Sean O'Mahony and the regional young members coordinator for Camera for uh, Greater Manchester and I'm also the chair of the Central Manchester branch as well. So officially in the role it's ensuring that young members are heard and any concerns that current young members have within Camera are relayed up to the region and national. However, uh, I want the remit to expand more for it to be a more of a active thing to get more young members within camera since the average age of camera members is quite old and if young members don't join camera will cease to be in a number of years so I'm making it my job making it my job to sign up more young members which is what I'm doing today um, so, Sean, you, you obviously somebody who's in control, if you like, or in charge, or trying to attract new members into camera. Is there not a danger, do you think, that people who don't know the the work of camera might think, oh, young people, beer, the two can be quite volatile. How do you how do you kind of get around that problem? Yeah. So. I, I completely agree and I didn't take on the role thinking it would be easy. I'm aware that there's a lot of stigma with camera and yep. camera has a reputation. A reputation of only being cast beer that is in what people usually call old men pubs. Uh, and if you do approach people, especially younger people, go, do you want to be part of camera? They will either go, what, either watch camera or oh that old man club thing no I'm fine <laughs> and it's, it's a real issue I completely yeah. agree and I think showing camera to be more than that actively is a way to sort of defeat that and uh, a few ways at least a few ways I'm trying to uh, get around that is by being a young face that's approaching and saying yeah. hey you know have you heard of camera you know are you camera member no right you know here are all the benefits uh, and just talking through it and give them a sort of different experience today to what they might have had because uh, i see at many uh, camera beer festivals there's usually a membership stand uh, with no young members on it and they just stay there uh, being passive, waiting for people to come to them. Yeah. But I want to be a young face that's actively walking out there, going to him, sitting down on the table, going, oh, you know, what are you drinking? Having a good time, you know, being involved in the conversation. That's one part, and the other part is to fight against the other stigmas. So, the part about it being an old man's club, you know, old traditional pubs, like, to get around that, I want to be promoting things like tap rooms, Manchester, as a uh, region, has many fantastic pubs. Yeah. It has a lot of family and traditional pubs, however, it's got many amazing tap rooms. Sonoma, by track, it's a beautiful cask beer. It's well known to be a Manchester cask beer, yeah. a yeah. real ale. Yeah. However, they do a lot of great keg beer, so having events at places like that, that already have a younger atmosphere, trying to sort of pivot camera into doing activities more like that, promoting side and pair it. I think all of that is quite key to fight against that stigma. I mean, just what what's the sort of trend at the moment, uh, Sean, with, with young people and alcohol? You know, you mentioned there, obviously, you're trying to um, enhance the, 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 the profile of the beers and the cascales and, and so on. But you also mentioned that, you know, rather like Jack here, um, who is, you know, he, he enjoys, you know, cider and, and will, you know, actively look on the programme of the, 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 the beer festival today for something that tickles his fancy in the cider and perry department. Well, are, are young people drinking an eclectic mix of stuff these days and does that make your job easier, maybe? Yeah, so I, I definitely think young, especially young people are drinking uh, the types of uh, alcohol that the older generation uh, drink less of. So, uh, from what I find, younger people aren't drinking as much bitter than milds, and they are going things so like cider, uh, or even the insane stuff like imperial stouts, 
are southwest from the likes of Bolt City right. who yep. uh, even have admitted they uh, only technically make beer they effectively have a base beer and add syrup in it to get the crazy flavours that they do <laughs> however if people enjoy it people enjoy it and it helps the brewers continue existing like Trap for example they yep. have yep. a they have an insane range of beers they have a stout called language barrier around a 10 percent imperial stout it tastes of coconut however if they're able to sell that they're able to make profit and if they're able to make profit they can still keep real ale alive they can still keep sonoma going so i think yes younger people's tastes are different however if camera ha- helps promote that more and helps those brew this it will uh by sort of like a knock-on effect help yep. real ale continue existing so they're still connected in that sense because the breweries do need to spy but yeah there's definitely young people i do find definitely drink different styles and yeah cider and heavy as well you're, which tamma is promoting you're, you're clearly very knowledgeable and very passionate about what you're doing sean uh, looking around the queen elizabeth hall here today are you pleased with the uh the kind of fruits of your labour, hey? you know, we've got one, we've got a few young people. It's uh, obviously you've got to be 18 at least. Yeah. Um, uh, are you pleased with with the turnout from that sector at this festival? Yeah. So in the first hour of the festival, uh, it didn't look like there were many people in the room under 30. However, uh, in the hour and a half after that, uh, I've seen more young members. Uh, Good join which I'm happy about and I've even talked to a few of them who aren't camera members and uh, some of them are uh, very interested for what camera has to offer and I do hope uh, later on in this festival they come back round, I go back to them and sign them up and uh, I'll be very pleased if I get a good few young members signed up today uh, and yeah I'm, I'm happy with the outcome so far I'd be even more happy if I get some of them to sign up. Brilliant. Uh, great to chat to you, Sean. Thank yes, you very much and good luck you. with your role. It's obviously a very valuable part of the organisation. Appreciate your time. Thanks, Thank you. Sean. Thank you.